Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you this holiday makeup look that I created. I thought it'd be really fun to do a bright look with a nice red bold lip for that nice holiday season. So I hope you guys all enjoy this tutorial and if you want to know how to get this look then just keep watching. Alright, so to start off this look, I'm going to be priming my face as always. And I'm using the Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer and this is the Smoothing Primer. Now I'm applying foundation and I'm using the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation, one of my favorite foundations right now. And I'm just buffing this into the skin using my Morphe M439 brush. This is just a round, dense brush and it applies foundation really nicely. And now I'm just applying concealer. I'm using my Naked Skin Complete Coverage Concealer from Urban Decay. I'm just putting this under my eyes on my eyelids to prime for eyeshadow and then blending everything out using my Beauty Blender. When blending this concealer out, I like to keep tapping my Beauty Blender back and forth to really make sure that this concealer is nicely blended out and to make sure that there is no creasing going on. And I'm also highlighting with this on my chin, my forehead, and down the center of my nose. And then going into my Kat Von D shade and light palette, I'm just mixing those two shades together and setting underneath my eyes using my Sigma F35 brush just to prevent the concealer from creasing or moving. And I'm also setting my eyelids so when I go in with eyeshadow, the eyeshadow will blend a lot easier. And then I'm just setting the rest of the areas where I put that concealer. Now going in with Makeup Geek Creme Brulee Eyeshadow, I'm applying this in the crease using my Sigma E40 brush. And this is going to act as a transition shade, so you just want to blend it back and forth in the crease. And then I will start doing circular motions. Now I'm applying Makeup Geek Latte in the crease and I'm using another Sigma E40 brush. This brush is a little bit more dense as opposed to the first one I was using. That one was a little bit more fluffy. And I'm just doing the same motions. I'm going back and forth and then doing circular motions outwards. Now I'm taking Makeup Geek Frappe and I'm applying this in the crease using my Morphe M433 brush and I'm also applying it a little bit to that outer part of my eyelid. And this brush is a really great blending brush, it just blends everything out really nicely. I'm taking that same Sigma E40 brush and just blending all of those shades together but still keeping it in the crease. Now I'm taking Makeup Geek Foiled Eyeshadow in the shade Starry Eyed and I'm applying it with my MAC 242 brush. I first sprayed the brush with a little bit of MAC Fix Plus just to intensify this color. So you just want to apply this eyeshadow all over the entire eyelid. And then taking Frappe again from Makeup Geek, I'm just putting this in the crease to blend out any harsh lines and I'm using my same Morphe M433 brush to do this. And now I'm taking another Makeup Geek eyeshadow and this is called Shimma Shimma. I'm just applying this in the inner corner of my eyes to highlight and also a little bit underneath my eyes in that inner corner. And I'm using my MAC 228 brush to do this. And this color just brightens up your eyes and gives them a nice pop. Now I'm lining my top inner waterline and I'm just doing this to give my eyes some more dimension. Now I'm just setting the rest of my face using my Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Powder. And I'm doing this to help the bronzer that I apply blend a lot easier and nicer. bronzer I'm using the Makeup Forever Pro Fusion bronzer and I'm applying it with my MAC 135 brush. I'm just going to bronze my cheeks, my jawline, and my forehead.
And I love the bronzy look that this bronzer gives me and applying it with this MAC brush it just makes it so amazing because this brush really does help bronze really nicely. Now for blush, I'm using this MAC blush in the shade Blush Baby, and I'm just applying it to my cheeks to give me a nice pop of color. Now for a highlighter, I'm using the Becca highlighter in the shade Opal, and I'm applying it to the tops of my cheekbones using the Morphe M501 brush. I love this highlighter, it gives you such a pretty glow to the face and it's just really great. And this brush that I apply it with is so great because it just really gets that highlighter in that nice exact spot. And now I'm applying the Bare Minerals Lash Domination Mascara to my top and bottom eyelashes. So now I'm going to show you guys two lip options. This first one is this Marc Jacobs lip gloss in the shade Sugar Sugar. Just a really pretty classic nude shade. So here is how the first option looks. Option number two is this Urban Decay lip gloss in number 69. This is just a really pretty bright red shade. Perfect for the holidays and I just love this color. So here's what this color looks like and it's just so pretty. To set my makeup in place, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. So that is it for this holiday makeup tutorial. I hope you guys all enjoyed it and I hope that this gave you guys an idea of some makeup looks to do during the holidays. So as always, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!